One of the good things that's come out of the last couple of days is I found that co-op cheese puffs are actually really good. They're very much on a par with that main brand of cheese puffs and much better than some of the other cheaper inferior supermarket brands. I just wanted to face the truth. Quite a harsh truth really. A simple truth. I've been quite <clears throat> I've been quite frenetic over the last few days. Basically ever since uh, we were told we were in lockdown. It's day four now. And I've made myself busy over the last few days just producing videos for YouTube. And the simple reality is I'm just distracting myself. Because I actually feel quite despondent. Um, in the space of just a few days, everything that I've worked so hard for for the last three years, everything that I've built up as a self-employed individual has just been decimated. And don't get me wrong, some of my customers have been great, offering ongoing support and so on. Um, but it's it's not just that, it's just, it's all gone. And, and I know that quite a few of them will go, quite a few of my existing customers will go. It's just such a dramatic forced change, not just for me, for everybody. I appreciate that, you know, I, you know it's, it, I appreci fully appreciate it's not just me. And there are so many other people in the same position. But this is my truth, and I have to, you know, there, there, there are things I have to face up to. I noticed it today. There's, I, I just don't, there's a part of me that doesn't even want to look into, which is crazy. I know this is about to sound really crazy, but there's a part of me that doesn't even want to look into this whole support thing that the government's offered and jump through all those hoops because. The whole point about being self-employed was to avoid jumping through other people's fucking hoops. You know, it was to get away from that. And now, forced back into jumping through other people's fucking hoops. And yeah, there's a part of me that is just totally avoiding that. Don't get me wrong, you know, I, I, you know, it, it will be something that I will sort. This is just the way I feel right at this moment in time with a big bag of cheese puffs and a double whisper and a glass of Disserano. I mean, thankfully, I have done, I've also, over the last few years, built up quite a sizable online presence in different areas. But even so, there's so much work involved in turning that round too. Um, it all feels just a bit overwhelming. I don't feel emotional about this. I feel numb. Completely and utterly numb. And that's kind of what's missing. The spark that I had is kind of missing. It just dropped in this afternoon. I was supposed to be doing some uh, a video with Ainsley and it just kind of dropped in. And yes, I hadn't slept so well last night and that didn't help. But that the, that the feeling just kind of enveloped me. It just kind of dropped over me. And I've had a, a long nap and woke up and I still feel the same. Hence the cheese puffs, the chocolate and the disserano. And... Yeah, I know, I know me, and I know that I will, I know that this feeling will pass, and I know that I'll end up tackling everything, sorting everything out, and going for it. But right at this moment in time, decimated, I just feel...
decimated. Take care of yourself. Stay indoors. Stay safe. Save the NHS.